one um, is called Fairy Tale. And uh, if you guys are friends with me on Facebook, you'll saw it. I posted it on Valentine's Day. And I don't really write happy love poems. And this is probably like the closest to a happy love poem I've ever written. So, let me tell you our story. We would build an empire from the ground up because we could change the world, you and I. Circle the globe in a day and write our manifesto upon the sky. Our city's temples would have minarets and stained glass, steeples and statues dipped in gold. The mosaics on its walls would glitter and it would instruct you to leave everything at the door and carry only your soul inside. We will pave the streets of our city with the asphalt of freedom and a revolutionary spirit will be the mortar that will bind together the bricks of every building you and I will build structures tall enough to kiss the sun, and we will dig deep into the earth and lay a foundation of compassion for them to stand on. Think about it for a second. You and I could be the architects of an entire awakening. We will scale every mountain because heights don't matter. The icy altitude would be a breeze to breathe in because your presence would move the air through my lungs just as our presence could move mountains as they loom above us, set to crush the world. But we, we will hold it up together, you and I. And there will be those who will doubt our dreams, who will make our beliefs seem bleak, but we will drown out their derision with the force of our laughter. <clears throat> Sorry, my voice. Laughing in the face of danger, for together we will find enough courage to share with those who are kept afraid. And your uplifted voice would harmonize with mine and weave a melody for all those who are forced to stay silent. In the metropolis that we devise, there will be no nihilists, no doomsayers, or puppet masters in state halls. There will be no ghettos or shanty towns or tyrants committed to keeping us down. There will no longer be a, si a system in place that perpetuates prejudice. Think about it for a second. The slums that we knew in our childhood would be after images kept alive only in history books. But well, wait a minute, that's not all. You will never be crushed by the weight of all your hopes for I will be there to bear what you cannot. And whenever I am lost in the forest of my convictions, your hands will guide me down the right path. And our spirits will never wither, our resolve will never fade, the flame of our passion will always burn, because together we are more compelling than we could ever be apart. This could be our story, but you have to help me write it. <laughs> Sanders. <laughs> <laughs> happening at, at FAT 2014. <laughs>